Boy, am I excited to share with you guys this information that I have because I have exclusive. I think I might be the first and only person that has this on YouTube. So we're going to be taking a look, a closer look at the Power Armor Edition that is going to be releasing for Fallout 76. Now, when I say exclusive first look is I am going to show you guys the T-51 wearable and I am really excited to share this with you guys because I don't think no one else has this footage and I will go into full detail on what you're able to do with the helmet how long does the battery life last and all that good stuff how does it look up close in the, in the video so make sure you guys stay tuned for that also almost towards the end of the video I'm going to show you guys other exclusive items that are going to be available for you to pick up if you're a fall, diehard fallout fan so I highly recommend you watch the full video so you're probably wondering laser what are you showing us right now so if you guys know the power armor edition comes with a map and this is like the bigger version of the map but you're also able to see kind of the way the uh, you know the little figurines look like so the, the that's why I wanted to show you the map so the map that we're going to be getting with the power edition that's going to be the west virginia map this is the bigger version this one that you're watching right now is not the virginia map but this is a bigger version that i wanted to give you guys an overall idea of what it was this is the mini game and this mini game actually comes with a lot of cool stuff and i kind of wanted to share it with you guys before we get into the nitty gritty of the wearable so what exactly does the power edition come with it comes with a west tech uh can canvas carrying bag which looks really really cool it comes with the wearable t51 power armor helmet which i'll like i said i'll detail a little bit later it also comes with a 21 by 20 map of the fallout 76 version of west virginia and it also glows in the dark if you guys saw the bethesda press conference you guys will know that it glows in the dark it also comes with fallout miniature figurines tiny plastic versions of the games of vault dwellers power armor wearing uh, wearing soldiers creatures and more this is kind of like an idea of what you guys are going to be getting when you guys get the map so now on to the good stuff guys let's take a look at the wearable so the wearable is a t51 power armor helmet and just by the looks of it you guys are seeing right here the size of this you know a lot of people thought it was going to be a little bit smaller but right here you're able to see how big this helmet is it's actually once you look at it up close or once you will have it in person it kind of feels like you are really really you know you're really in the suit once you get the helmet not only that but the helmet comes with a few features i don't know if you guys are aware of it comes with a built-in voice modular speaker and that voice modular speaker is actually activated by clicking on the button on the side of the helmet not only that but on the other side of the helmet you also are able to turn the lamp off and on so it's a lead lamp which gives you that positive vibe and one of the questions i asked is how long will the lead lamp last if you guys are wearing this kind of maybe to cross play are you wearing it at home or you're just you know kind of just wearing it to role play then what you're going to want to know is this is going to last you a total of eight hours with some batteries you're going to need some uh, batteries to actually operate this one and you guys should be good to go and that battery will be able to last not only that but you're also able to bring down the scope if you want to and the nice addition of this is once you guys go ahead and check the helmet from the bottom it comes with a nice little mesh to avoid any sort of looseness plus it also comes with a cap inside that allows you to adjust the uh, the helmet based on your head size which is a really good addition a nice thing I noticed about the helmet as well, it has a very nice finish to it. So it looks like it's really well done. It's trying to avoid, I was told that they try to avoid as much possible showing any screws or having any sort of seams to give it a nice professional look. They also said they added a little bit wear to the helmet. So when you get the helmet, you kind of already know that you're a survivor from that nuclear blast and it's just extremely amazing well crafted well designed and i know that the, it's kind of right now limited edition every it's sold out everywhere i i was asking if there was going to have a little bit more so they just said to keep checking with your local store they should have some more a little bit closer to the end of when we get closer to the uh, release of the game so i'm really excited if you guys did pick up a limited edition let me know in the comment section down below if you did and for what console did you guys pick it up for the pc xbox one playstation 4 now if you guys are a huge fallout fan and i highly recommend you watch the rest of this video i'm going to showcase you guys a couple new things that are there i was also told that there was going to be a brand new drink that was coming out and also some weapons that you're going to be able to purchase which would all be available as soon as the release of the game is out so i'm really excited because these look really dope let me know which one stands out to you the most which one do you guys like and don't forget guys for continual e3 coverage and full fallout 76 coverage Make sure you guys keep it locked to this channel and I will catch you guys on the next video.